Hey, Jesse Mills here. So if you've been through the mortgage process anytime recently, or maybe you've had some friends or family go through the process, you know there's some things to do and there's some things to not do, all right? And now I've been doing this for almost 15 years and I've seen some things, oh man, I've seen them just completely blow up at the end and derail a two month process because someone didn't listen and did something they shouldn't have done. Maybe they didn't know any better. Maybe they didn't ask. But you know what? I don't want you to be in that spot. I don't want you to think you're moving into your house on Friday morning and you come to find out Thursday afternoon you're not going to get the house that you are already in love with, that you've already in your head planted the flowers and you know you've already got rooms painted in your head, right? You're not going to get it. Why? What the heck? What do you mean? We've been working on this for six weeks, eight weeks. Well, something changed, okay? I don't want that to happen to you, but guess what? It can happen, and it does happen. So it's crucial that you know what to do and what not to do. Guys, we're in a day and age where no one's going to believe you. We can't believe you. This is money. We're talking hundreds of thousands of dollars here. We're talking about millions of loans that get packaged off and sold off on Wall Street and investors and billion dollar banks, right? There's no, you know, taking my word for it. So there's paper trails for everything. Everything needs to be backed up. You need proof. You need to verify. And if something doesn't make sense, don't get offended. Don't get mad. But be ready to answer a lot of questions, okay? Where's this money? Where did it come from? And can you prove it? Yep, those are the kind of questions you're going to get asked. you got to know that, all right? So there's some things that I've got listed here on the checklist below that, trust me, take this from my 15 years of professional experience, day in, day out doing this. Do the things I tell you to do down below. You'll be just fine. Don't do the things that I list below or you're in for some hurt, okay? And you're in for a horrible experience and a lot of stress and a lot of anxiety, maybe some lost money, definitely some sleepless nights. But if you don't do those and you do what I tell you to do, you're probably going to be just fine, all right? So I look forward to helping you gain some knowledge, wisdom, and have a much better experience when you are in the home buying process.